So for today's project, we're going to make a super fast and easy project. So we're going to convert um, our charm bracelet into a unique necklaces. So we need, of course, a charm bracelet. So when you say charm bracelet, it should have um, a lot of dangling pieces to call it a um, charm bracelet. And also... Um, I'll be using this metallic string or in case if you don't have one you can use thin chains or even a uh, thin ribbon as an alternative or you can use whatever string that you have as long as it can match to your bracelet and also a button and a clear colorless nail polish or top coat so if you also have a, a charm necklaces you can also use that so since i don't have one i'm going to use this charm bracelet this is actually super old i have it maybe um 10 years or five years ago so first is we're going to cut a generous amount of string so maybe just about this length and then so the first style that you can do is you can open the bracelet like so and then just Add the string at the end. Just make a regular knot. So I'm going to knot it three times just to make sure that it is secured. And then you can use a super glue or even a colorless top coat to secure the knots. Like so, then just let it dry. Then do the same on the other side. So, I just move the camera. And then I'm going to cut another string. So, going to attach it to the end, to the other end of my bracelet. Like so, and then just knot it again three times, just like what we did. And then the next step is we're going to measure it. So, it's up to you how you want it, if you want it long or short. So, I want it up to this length. So, here. I'm going to attach the button. So, here. there and then just knot it again three times just 
used a regular knot. Like so. Then again, add a top coat or super glue to secure the knots. Then let it dry again before cutting the excess. Now to the other side. Since we're letting it dry, so we're going to cut the excess from the ones we knotted before. So here, I'm going to cut the excess. And here also. First, measure it. So, how to measure it? It's like this. See? And then. So, here is my other string or strand. So, of course, you have to measure the loop according to the size of your button. Like so. And then, measure it again. So, it's up to here and then just make an overhand knot so before you tighten it make sure that it can fit your button there And then and I'm going to knot it again two times so just a regular knot just to make sure that it is secured again Like so, and then I'm going to add another top coat, or you can use super glue. Then let it dry before cutting the excess strand or string. So now this one is dry, so we can now cut the excess strand. Like so. So we have to wait for it to dry first before cutting. So now that it's now dry, we can cut the excess strand. Like so. So here, how it looks like. So 
so that is design number one so the next design is we're going to close the bracelet like so and then again we're going to cut a generous length of string and then going to add string so determine first where you want to add your string add my string here so it's going to be a double layer necklace again just a regular knot just knot it three times again Then just add the coat then let it try and get another piece of string going to place it here so the same just make a regular knot three times and again the coat And let it dry first before cutting the excess so same thing we're going to measure it again on the length that you desire so I want it up to there this is my guide so I'm going to Add the button first. Then add the coat. Then let it dry before cutting. So, since the knots that we did earlier is already dry, we can now cut the excess. so and then we're going to make a loop so to do that to have the same length to the other side grab the ends of your bracelet like so Then, so here is my other loop measure your button so the same thing as before we did this earlier so the coat is already dry then we can Cut the excess string and 
can cut the excess there too. Same thing, then just like so. So here is design number two. Like so, so that's it. Hope you guys like it. Please visit and subscribe to my channel for more DIY projects. Thanks for watching. Bye.